Hey all, my name's Soul, and welcome to the channel. I am admittedly not the best at doing intros, but hey, I am a furry slash fluffy, or at least um, trying to get more into that um, sort of thing. I am a very proud Christian, and I'm really excited to be doing this sort of thing now. I've actually been making videos for quite a long time. These aren't my first videos, but this is definitely different from the videos that I've been doing before. Today I just wanted to give you guys a little bit of an intro to who I am, I guess, a little bit of my story, you know, like how I discovered like furry slash fluffy stuff, where my sonas went, um, like where I am now, and sort of where I want to go and stuff. This video isn't going to be terribly edited or anything, it's probably just going to be gameplay while I talk, so feel free to do something else in the background. Um, so yeah. Hope y'all enjoy, and yeah, here's a little bit of a background on me, Soul. Um, I was born a Christian, I was raised a Christian, um, my entire family is Christian, um, I was, I really didn't start to, like, think about all this Christian stuff until I was, like, s uh, maybe, like, 10 or 11 years old. When I was, like, 6 or 7, I had, like, um, you know, an awareness of, like, yeah, this exists and stuff, but, like, yeah, I don't know about it, but then... When I was around like 11 or 12, I was like, okay, yeah, this, like, God is real, and like, I want to devote my life to him. And so, when I was 13, I was baptized at my church, uh, which is pretty cool and stuff. And I've just been uh, following the Lord ever since. Of course, I'm not perfect, but, you know, according to what Paul said, I am working towards that. I am working towards being who I am in Christ. My first sort of encounters with furry things was a couple of things, actually. First of all, um, so when I was a kid, I was actually, like, really terrified of mascots for whatever reason. If I saw them at theme parks, I would, like, go out of my way to, like, find uh, the most convoluted route, like, around them so I wouldn't have to interact with them. I remember there was a hockey game we went to once, and there were about ten different mascots, like, at the front entrance, which terrified me. And I remember just, like, sitting in my seat and just having, like, one eye on the game and the other eye just, like, all around the stands trying to, um, find the mascots. Um, cause, like, yeah, again, I, I was terrified of them. Um, but over time I grew to, like, I was like, oh, wow, like, this, like, mascot thing is, like, really cool. Like, I kind of want to do that and stuff. Um, and so, like, you know, a little bit later I discovered, like, you know, like, oh, there's, like, a furry, like, uh, furry fandom. Where it's, like... Oh, people, like, actually, like, make their own, like, mascots and costumes and stuff, and they do silly and fun things, and I was like, wow, like, this is, like, this is, like, super fun. This seems, like, super duper fun. I would, like, definitely, like, want to do something like that. I remember once, uh, um, with my family, we went to, like, this, um, this clay painting place, and I think one of the things you could paint there was a dog. And so, like, at the time, I was pretty set on my first, like, Sona, like, being a dog. And I think it was, like, this, like, weird, like, green slash yellow thing. Like, one half of him was green and the other half of him was yellow. And it was, like, it, it, it was crazy. I was, like, really young then. Um, but, like, I can't lie and say, you know, like, I wasn't, like, made fun of for, like, being interested in that sort of thing. I remember, like, you know, like, saying, um, talking about it to my friends and stuff, like say like oh hey like i'm interested in like animal like mascot costumes and stuff and like i want to do this sort of stuff and you know like um i remember um you know like there are people that you know like they would like make fun of me and stuff there were some people who were like yeah that's cool and like um i know like the people who were like making fun of me didn't like mean it they didn't mean it to be like you know like, like they were still my friends but they um they were they were still kind of like what like like huh <laughs> um and this is like more of a me thing, but personally for me, I am very, um, I am very sensitive. Um, one thing that I said on like my bio, you know, like I'm, I'm autistic and this is by no means, um, something that I like identify with. I'm not gonna like come up to you and say like, hi, I'm autistic, <laughs> but, um, I do like suffer with, um, or I do go through like, you know, like social anxiety and um just like social awkwardness and stuff i have a lot of trouble <laughs> um talking to people and like even when i like do like talk to people and stuff i have a lot of trouble with things like making eye contact and um 
and like I, I I tend to like fidget and stuff or stutter like I'm doing now. Um, and so like you know like I sort of like ditched that for a while. Um, that was like when I was 14, and I di and I ditched it for like a really long time. I'd say up until I was like, honestly, up until I was like 20 or so. Um, and like my only exposure to that um, sort of community was this sort of side of like, oh, it's weird, oh, it's like not, the, not something that you should do, like, oh, it's just like a sex thing, or whatever, and stuff. Um, I remember like as a kid, like taking like various like quizzes and stuff. When I took my first furry quiz, I think like they said like my soda, was, or like my sona should be like a cheetah, which I didn't really like because I don't like cats. Um, <laughs> Or not, not that I don't like cats, but I like dogs, like, way better. I like canines way better. Um, so yeah. And then, like, eventually, like, when I started to, um, like, come back to the sort of thing and think about, like, what sort of sona I wanted, I was like, oh, like, maybe I'll be a wolf. Like, wolves are cool. I really like wolves. And then I learned that, like, wolves are, like, really, really common. <laughs> so then I was like, oh, okay. So maybe I want to be, like, something a little bit more unique. And that's sort of when I, um... That's sort of when I decided on a deer, because I was like, okay, well, deers are, like, deers aren't predators, but deers are, you know, like, they're shy, um, they're really cute, I really like them, um, they have, like, really cool colors and stuff, and I like their antlers and their hooves and stuff, and they're just, like, you know, like, God made so many cool animals, and, um, you know, like, deers are just one of them and stuff, and that's the one that I tend to really like. So, you know, like, praise praise God for that. Praise God for all of his wondrous creation. You know, it says in the Bible that, you know, like, let everything that has breath praise the Lord. Everything in creation points to God, which is really, really good. I, 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 I take a lot of comfort in that. Um, and so recently, you know, like, as of a couple months ago, I started, like, looking more into, like, um... You know, like, the furry community, like, the fluffy community, things like that. Um, and I was, like, looking specifically for, like, Christian furries because I was like, okay, well, you know, it's like, if I want to do this thing, I also want to be with people or I want to interact with people who I know will um, help me in my faith journey. Um, because one thing, um, you know, uh, I, I don't know if I said this, like, in my bio or whatever, but, like, I, I'm a recent university graduate. I just graduated with my... Um, with a degree in music but one of the things that I didn't really do a lot during university is I didn't have a lot of like Christian friends to hang out with and stuff and I think this is partially due to the fact that you know like when um when I was in university I um especially in like my third and fourth years my church attendance was rather inconsistent um a lot of the time I would just like watch my church online and there was this other church that I went to, but I, um, I wasn't, like, the most convinced with that church. Um, and, uh, yeah, and, like, there was one church that I went to, um, in, like, my first year and stuff, but then I stopped going to that, admittedly because of, like, laziness, and I shouldn't have done that looking back. Um, so, yeah, I, did, I didn't have a lot of, like, Christian friends and stuff, and so I really just wanted, like, people to, um to uh, uh help like embolden my faith and stuff and you know like as of recently i found minty chip mocha's channel which like i saw it and i was like oh wow like like a furry who's like a christian and like a bold one like that is honestly like so amazing to see like i don't know about any of you guys but i get so so excited when i see other christians just, just like seeing the fact like a Christian furry and seeing someone like so bold about their faith, that made me go like, yes, like, yes, that's so awesome. Like, thank you, Lord. <laughs> like, like, praise, praise the Lord. Um, and once I like knew that there was this like sort of thing that existed, I was like, okay, well, like, what's stopping me from just, what's, what's stopping me from, uh, you know, like going all in? What's stopping me from really trying to do this again, get into this again? and try to spread the word in, like, you know, like, the furry, fluffy community and stuff. Um, cause, like, I'll be real, like, I, I don't have a fursuit, and, like, that's always been my dream. My dream has been to have a fursuit, and the reason for that is, like, I don't want one, like, necessarily to, like, go to cons or anything, 
my dream is to get one because you know I want to I just want to make people happy um, a lot of my jobs throughout the years have been working with kids um, you know at like um, I, I work at like summer camps almost every summer and so honestly like kind of what I want to do with the first is I just want to go with like first who like at a summer camp and just make kids happy or even just like um um you know like I'm a music teacher just like every once in a while just like go with like go with like teach in fursuit I think that would be really fun <laughs> um I just want to like make like kids and just make people's uh days better and show them the love of Christ show them the love of the truth of Christ and that's always been um my sort of dream with this so I'm hoping that becomes a reality um someday if y'all know any like really good like Christian fursuit makers please let me know please put them down in the comments i'd be more than down to see them um anyways yeah that's about it uh this is 11 minutes long now wow um if you made it to the end here thanks for watching um i really appreciate it and hopefully i'll have more stuff for y'all uh at some other point um i forget if i said this before but like i will i think i'll do like a proper testimony soon um, so yeah, look forward to that. Anyways, uh, thanks for watching. Know that I love you and God wants you. Have a blessed day. See ya.